My name is Amy Wardwell and I work at Champlain Valley Union High School. At RUTN I've learned about using different equipment, so how to put together and use effectively um, camera equipment, audio equipment, lighting equipment, as well as uh, learning iMovie, which was an editing software that I wasn't familiar with. I've learned a lot about um, the filmmaking and video recording process and I think that's really helped me to refine a, a particular project that we do in my classroom which is students make short silent films so they have to tell a story without using any dialogue to advance their story it's all with the different camera work they do and so working with RETN I learned a lot more about how to do basic cinematography and make it effective we have done doc short documentary films in the past so we talked you know about interviewing people and thinking of uh, different things to think about when you're doing kind of documentary footage as well. Some of those resources that RETN has provided um, have really helped me to kind of get that conversation going with students. Scott and Doug with some other folks from RETN had come in and given a workshop and the kids were really using some of the ideas and using some of the language. We've been filming um, our Pure Cinema projects the last two weeks and we borrowed tripods from RETN that had sort of the ball joint. We had extra cameras to work with, so I had one group that for the first time was shooting um, the same scene with two different cameras so that they could change camera angles um, when they were editing. They were more able to get the shot that they were trying to, to capture because of the equipment that we'd borrowed. It's really important for students to know that their work is going to be published. Having a showplace for that work um, helps them to sort of begin to have that sense of um, and encouragement for doing the best quality work that they can. Anytime that they are putting something that has their name attached to it out there, it's got to be representative of the quality that they would want to be associated with. The services that RETN provides are incredibly valuable. This technology is, um, is expensive and for a lot of schools I know they don't have access to this kind of equipment and so having RETN as a community resource to help supplement um, with equipment and expertise that a lot of classroom teachers may not have um, is really invaluable and it's a terrific community resource.